So I have been watching um, Love on the Spectrum. I had watched season two before season one. And now I'm watching season one. I've been so emotional because I'm on my period. And um, so I've been like crying on and off and shit. But this stuff right here, these people are so sweet. It's a beautiful thing. So I be crying for that reason because they're so innocent and they truly express how they feel. But this couple right here, this couple future feature in season two. And I was like, this is some beautiful shit right here. Because they so innocent. That's crazy. But they just such a good match with each other because he know how to communicate with her. And he's very optimistic. You're in love with each other. Cute. Oh, you two adorable kitties. I love cats. I am a, a cat person. I just been watching this shit. And these people really are different. You get what I'm saying? Because I watched season two first. And it's like, they really sync up with each other. It's interesting. This is so fun. Yeah, I love this spice. Thanks. So do I. <laughs> just sit on the bench and just enjoy. Hold on. I want to go back so I can show y'all some more, some more of them. Like when they first met. Oh, I like your shirts. I see you have sharks on your shirt. Thank you. I also love how expressive they is. But they instantly got along. You know, you could tell that these are some motherfucking soulmates. That's so cool. What's your name? David. What's nice your... to meet you. I'm Abby. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Abby. So nice. What's your favorite animal? The African lion. Me too. You know they made a live action version of the Lion King and sent it to Beyonce. Wow, I did not know that. Yeah, she has an amazing voice. I've been to Africa since winter break. You have? Yes. They are so cute. It's ridiculous. I just be watching this stuff about to cry like all the time. Y'all should watch this. It's really good for the heart chakra. Like, when I'm emotional and stuff, when I'm open like this, I'm very open right now. Very, very, very open. Um, I try to find something that is good for the heart chakra or the universe would present the opportunity and I take it because I came across this show before but never thought to watch it because I really don't like love shows like that and whatnot because you know I'm too sensitive to the energy so I'd be like this is on fuck shit this on fuck shit but these people are so innocent. Like, it's real. It's genuine. It's really good for the heart chakra. So, yeah. Go check it out. 